Hi guys, Cranky Cows here. And the Sherpster. And we're back with more Yakuza 3. So in the last episode, we found out Shiro, one of the boys in our orphanage, was being bullied by his teacher's son. Um, and if I remember rightly, the teacher basically implied that some counsellor would make our lives difficult if we kicked up a fuss. Um, but then we were talking to somebody else near the orphanage and they were like, oh no, this dude's cool. So we're going to go talk to this counsellor and sort this out because it's not okay that our kid's getting bullied. So we, we need to go up to the monorail, I think. Yeah, because we can get to the golf course. So we're going to go have a nice game of golf with him and it will all be fine. <laughs> <laughs> Assuming you're actually going to play golf and not just talk to him. We're at a country club, so so that's kind of... Oh, I've got a fixed camera angle. Stay. Yeah, so I'm guessing you need to talk to that dude over there. Yeah, this is weird. It's like I can't move around freely. Are you a member of the club? Not technically. Uh, no. <laughs> do I need to get a guest pass? My deepest apologies, but this is a highly exclusive club. Um, for local businessmen and government blah, 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 government officials only. If you don't have an invitation, I'm going to have to ask you to leave. Oh, great. Okay. Damn. Hello. Oh, if you'll allow me to intrude, who are you? Um, why don't you join me for a couple of holes? Who are you? Hmm. Meant to meet a friend here, but it seems he won't be showing up. Not too fond of playing by myself, so if you wouldn't mind joining me, I'd be glad to have you along. Oh, that's very nice of you. <laughs> ah, ah, exactly the guy you need anyway, so that's great. So, first impressions are good. He seems yes. like a nice dude. Yeah. It's Kiryu. Kiryu-chan! <laughs> no, he's much more polite. Kiryu-san. Yeah, Kiryu-san. <laughs> Oh, Aha, no. So you are going to play golf. <laughs> oh, this is going to be um, okay. entertainment. Uh, oh, too many buttons and things. Start swing, build power. Okay, let's just go for it. We'll manage. You go for it. You take the first shot and then after that we'll be constantly behind you and we'll probably have to take loads of shots if it's anything like Wii Golf. Do you remember playing Wii Golf? I where it do. was like. In, remember playing Wii Golf, yes. Where it took like, no oh, do I have to do it? I think it's just maybe giving you a tutorial. Use L1 and R1 to adjust the shot direction. Okay. Like that. Am I playing as him though? Change clubs by tilting the right stick up and down. Oh, getting a bit technical with wedges and irons. Press triangle to change the shot range to half the distance. Okay. <laughs> wow. Yakuza's always been pretty detailed when it comes to its minigames, though, yeah, hasn't it? Yeah, putting some spin on the ball. Cool. Got it. Right. Um... Okay, so that's how much power we want. So we press it up there and then on the way back as well. Mm -hmm. wow. Yeah, so I think it's a case if you hold it, let go of it and then press it. I think that's how we read it. No, I think you have to press at the top. Hey, you're pretty good. I'm not sure I'd go that far. No, I wouldn't. Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> not really. So we're just going to do it, are we? Um, yeah. And? Uh, okay, okay, okay. I got this. Right, so we're on the, the fairway. That is good. That's what we want. Did, okay, yeah. Because if I do it too far, it's going to go off the thing. Yep, yeah, fair enough. So, I'm, well, although I could just do it not max power. Hmm. I'm going to play it safe. Okay. Uh, and I'm just going to hit it straight down there. Where's the wind speed? That way. So let's... Oh, I don't know if I want to do that. If I hit it that way, it will go... Oh, I don't know. I'm just going to keep it straight. And factor in the wind speed a little bit. 
Oh fuck. Somehow that was a nice nice shot. Uh no, I'm good. We'll we'll save it there. Oh, I literally got like I didn't even get on that fuck. Okay. Yeah, cuz I think like I said, I think it's a case if you hold X for the power, let go hold of it at it. the top and then Oh, I <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I am in the rough, so that makes it harder. Mm hmm. Okay. Okay, we got it. We got it. That's better. <laughs> You're on the fairway, so it's all good. Okay. How many? Par four. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, this is stroke three, so you could still do it. Nice. Yes. Uh, oh, it was a bit too good though, and I'm right near a tree. No, I'll keep that. So now he's gonna have a go. That's I, oh, very high. For I'm gonna end up playing. To be. I'm gonna end up playing this for ages. Oh, off no. camera. <laughs> right? Do I want to change? Where am I? Oh no, that's gonna go too far. So I want that right. Maybe change your. I'm change at half power. Club. Oh, I can change my club. Um, can't remember how. How do I right analog it? stick? Up right. and down. I don't want a putter. Mm -hmm. Putter would be bad. Sand wedge. A something wedge. I can't remember what a P wedge is. Nine don't want iron. a nine iron. Um, if I use a putter, I'm in the rough though. I'm going to use a sand wedge, even though I'm not in the sand. To do a really, I'm going to put really a little bit of a backspin on it so it doesn't go. Oh, it might end up in the bunker. Oh no, wait, that's over the other side. Sorry, I'm looking at the wrong thing. You know what? <clears throat> Fuck. It's on there. Enough wrongs make a right, so it's all good. <laughs> oh dear. Struck five. Okay, I can do this. She says confidently. It doesn't have a thing like on the Wii to know how much to like wang it. Like, I don't know what sort of power level I need to do Technical there. Technical terminology here, of course. <laughs> oh, balls. Oh, it was pretty good. <laughs> no, let's just keep going. It's fine. We'll get this over yeah, with. Yeah, he's on the par. You're on double bogey at the moment. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Triple, triple bogey. bogey! Not bad for your first <laughs> attempt. Can we stop now? <laughs> it's yeah. just going to carry on circul circulating. I think I hit it a little too hard. And they're not hard enough. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. That happens to everyone when they're first starting out. All you need is more practice. And a bit of skill. Do we have to? Apparently so. Are we going to have like the whole course? It won't be 18 holes, I'm sure. Even nine's enough. Mm -hmm. What sort of work do you do, Kiryu Sam? Um, oh yeah, we're legit now. We run an orphanage. Yeah, yeah we're, we're not yakuza. Taking care of all those children is quite a task. Oh, nothing makes me happier than seeing them smile. Mm. Okay, let's try and be more competent this time. Hole in one. Oh wait, <laughs> that was a little bit good. Right, I'm going to go for it more this time. So I've got the wind with me. So I'm going to hit it slightly on the back end. I don't want to properly wang it, do I? No. Oh. Well, that's... Oh, well, wow, nice. Not quite as good Not as quite. his. But... Well, his was actually a little bit further, I think. So. Okay. Uh. On the green. Right, do you reckon I can do this in, in one? Probably not. Oh. Not if you hit it like that. <laughs> oh, I meant to hold it down. I keep letting go. Yes, I'll retry that shot. Let's try and do that better. <laughs> Bit too hard that time. <laughs> you can do the next one, okay? Okay. We're going to be here forever, aren't we? 
<laughs> That's how you do it. That apparently. is how you do it. Birdie! So he's going to be rather happy about that. Fuck's sake. <laughs> Yay, Yay! Another triple another bogey! Triple bo right, you're doing the next one. Screw it. Okay. Speaking of the orphanage, how many kids do you have there? Uh, nine. All in elementary school. You take care of them all by yourself? Do you have any helpers? No, but the oldest girl, Haruka, takes on a lot of that responsibility. She'll be starting sixth grade next month. So she's, so she's still at school as well. Yeah. When the chores are divided up between all the kids, everyone has to help out. How wonderful. Too many kids these days sit around watching TV while their parents do all the work. Hmm. <laughs> now, shall we head to the next hole? Yep. You're on plus six, he's on minus, minus one. one. <laughs> well, then. Next hole. As a professional, Kiryu-san, what are your thoughts on the youth of today? Well, things were definitely different when I was a kid, but with how drastically the world has changed, I guess that's not too much of a surprise. I'd say the real problem is that we spoon-feed everything to kids nowadays. There's no room for imagination ever anymore. Back in my day, we'd come up with <laughs> games we could all play together when we were bored. <laughs> okay, that's nice, Kiryu. Cool. These days, it's all about video games and the internet. <laughs> From what I hear, most kids would rather stay in their rooms than go outside to play. Hmm. Yeah. Guilty. <laughs> Guilty. <laughs> when we were kids, anyway. Yep. I love how meta this conversation mm. is. Children nowadays certainly have it good, but in a way I feel sorry for them. Bullying seems to have grown more prevalent as well. I will admit it's always been present, but incidents appear to be even more malicious recently. Interesting. Yes. <laughs> Perhaps the children of today lack basic consideration for their fellow students. Hmm. Looks like it, yeah. Oh, like, come on, I need you to, to like. I'm not sort gonna come along and make up seven shots to do <laughs> realise this. Not, are you? Oh god, how the hell am I gonna get it all the way over there? Just wang it. I can get it all the way over there. Full power. And if I sort of angle it slightly because of the fact. Yeah. Oh, god. Not bad. Not bad for a first attempt. Hey, that's. Pro Hey, that's pretty oh, good. Oh, slightly out of bounds. Can uh, I retry it? Yeah, because I reckon that was pretty good. You can do the golfing. Don't go out of bounds again, you little fuck. <laughs> I'm in the rough. No, I'm happy with that. Hmm. So you should be. I think that was pretty good. Fair way. Green. Okay. Uh, so right. you're on a wedge. You don't want a putter yet, I don't think. And definitely not a nine iron. No, I was just going through to see if I could. You're a little bit too good at this. Uh, it's luck. Yeah, no, keep, I'm happy keep with it. That. Yeah, keep it. Oh, it's me. Yeah. <laughs> yes, birdie! Not bad for a first attempt. He's like, yes. We're now at plus five. <laughs> <laughs> you can try and like win the game after my atrocious start. How about that? <laughs> Kiryu san, I have another question about your children, if you don't mind. How do they spend their free time? Well, we don't have a computer or any games, so for the most part, they all play together outside. All the older kids really look after the younger ones, too. It's like we're one big family. Aww. This is all a little bit that too That sounds twee. lovely. <laughs> It'd be alright if I paid you a visit sometime. Yeah. Of course. I'd be glad to have you. Okay. We're only five behind him now. It's all good. Oh, display results. Oh, we finished Oh, that's second. it. Yeah, three holes. Anyway. Oh, well. Back to you. <laughs> I'm glad we let him win. 
I have to thank you for the match, Curious Anne. Golf isn't much, isn't much without an enjoyable conversation to go with it. I hope I'll have the chance to stop by your orphanage sometime soon. And I mean that sincerely. We'd love to have you. Perhaps there's even some way the city could support all the charitable work you do for those children. If you ever need anything, please feel free to give me a call. I'll do everything within my power to help you. About that. Hmm. I appreciate that, Akasaka-san. <laughs> Farewell, Farewell now. now. And before I forget, I signed you up with my permanent guest list, so you'll be free to visit the club whenever you please. Perhaps we'll even play again sometime. Sounds good to me. We definitely will. I can see myself doing that off camera. He had nothing but nice things to say about Morning Glory. I bet that'll make Shiro feel better. Okay, so back to Morning Glory then? Yeah. Oops, sorry lady. You pushing people out of the way again. Where do you want to go? Um, back to Morning Glory then. Mm -hmm. In the interests of story progression? Yeah, I was trying to work out whether we wanted to do anything extra there, but mm. I think we'll just go back for now and talk to Shiro. The um, the camera stuff is a bit... Oh, he's oh. there already. That was quick. I told you I'd stop by, didn't I? I wasn't yeah, expecting it wasn't to be so soon. Yeah, I wasn't expecting it to be so soon. <laughs> tai Chi in the house. Yo, Uncle Kaz. Hey, you forgot to say hello to our guest. Take your shoes off before you go inside. Hi, Uncle Kaz. We're home. You two have a good day at school? Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, a guest. guest. <laughs> oh, aren't they so cute? Yeah. Hello there, kids. <laughs> Such energetic kids. Oh, look, he's... Being properly so beaten up. Magedaka. <笑>元気な子供ですな。あれ、お客さん。ああ、挨拶しろ。初めまして、シロです。ほう、ちゃんと挨拶もしっかりできて気持ちのいい子だ。おい、あんたが桐生だな。この子供に。あんたが。どうしてくれるんだ。ああ、橋本さん。お久しぶりですね。ん?へ。ああ、ああ、赤坂先生。ふん。ふん。ふん。ふん。ふん。ふん。ふん。ふん。ふん。ふん。ふん。
was so worried when I heard he was getting bullied, but I'm glad everything's going to be okay. Me too. Why do I get the feeling something is going to happen now off the back of that? Quite possibly. Hashimoto is going to send some people over or something like that. Maybe. All right, let's go. Let's go get dinner. Okay. The pacing of this is quite slow to start with. I have seen that being a bit of a criticism of Yakuza mm -hmm. 3. Give me my money back. I don't have it right now. Can you wait until I get my allowance? Okay. We don't do that sort of thing, Tai Chi. You better pay me back soon, liar face. Okay, let's go talk to her and find out what's going yeah, on. Yeah, Tai Chi seems a bit of a, a live wire himself, just in general. Why didn't you pay him back? Did you lose the money? When you borrow something from someone, you have to make sure you give it back. I, um... Someone, someone stole, stole it. Ah, oh, Hashimoto's little shit, probably. Ah. Mm. Are we going to do all of the kids' problems? Uh, it this seems like it at this rate, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, wait for me in the dining room. Okay, then. Right, let's go get the other kids. Oi, kids, dining room now. <laughs> uh. Okay, he's a lot... Uh... Friendly, oh, does he think it's one of the other kids in the orphanage? It looks like it, yeah. Oh, that's not that's not good. Did something happen? Okay. Okay, so that's two of the nine. Obviously, um, there might I've be forgotten her the... name already. The girl who's actually got the uh, the issue. Um, yeah, I she's as well. the third <laughs> one as well. Tai Chi. There we go. Might be Izumi. No, it's Ayako, I think. Ayako. There we Ayako. go. I am doing I am. something. Go in the dining room, kid. Not sure yet. Just want to have this meeting. Of course, it could be somebody external who's come in. It's not like we're that secure, is it? I mean, no. We are quite remote, though, at the same time. So that's four of the nine. Mm -hmm. There's another three. Koji. Oh. Dining room, now. <laughs> Gonna have a house meeting. You'll know soon enough. Just go wait for me. Right. Right. And two more. Possibly in another part of the house. Um. Because those aren't kids. Those aren't kids. There's no kids there. It's the older ones. I bet they're not. Hmm. Oh, is that one? That was Zayako, I think. Huh. Okay. Maybe round here. There's another door out there, so potentially. Oh, oh. or maybe not. Hmm. Have a look in the dining room, see how many kids you've got. Enter. Oh. That's the save room. Ah. I'll do a quick save while we're at it. Cool. Okay, so where have these kids got to? So, oh, we went around that way, didn't we? We did. That's the dining room. Are they all in there? No, I don't think they are. In the kitchen? Maybe. Haruka's in the kitchen, so you could ask She's her to cooking, be in there. She's cooking, so we could talk to... Where have you been? We're supposed to be getting dinner ready. Looks like dinner's going to have to wait. Why? Money's gone missing. Okay, so Haruka needs to go. Yep. It's the two older kids, I think, that aren't around. Unless they are outside. Somewhere. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. I can count there, I think. Uh, one, two, three. Uh, I think seven. Seven. Seven, okay. Ayako's eight. So, so we're missing the two older ones that were sort of. I thought they said there were nine kids. Yeah, so seven plus two. But Ayako's one of them. And Ayako, I think, was still in the bedroom. Or in the room where you oh. spoke to her. Okay, well then one of them's. Get on over to the dining room. 
Something doesn't seem right, does it? So one of them's missing. Maybe that's definitely... Well, there's eight school that, bags there. That's eight. What do you mean? There's eight school bags in the thing. Oh. Unless that handbag on the top is also one. Dunno. Ah. No. Riona. There's something we need to talk about. Wait for me in the dining room, okay? Okie dokie. So I think that is everyone. That. She was one of the old ones that I was mm -hmm. looking for. Right, cool. That um, is nine anyway, so yeah, let's and he's go. just said that's everyone, so let's go to the dining room. Yeah, the pacing of this is quite slow. Um, mm. I've heard that's a criticism of Yakuza 3. Hopefully we'll be doing slightly more interesting things soon. And that's pretty much all we know. Ayako's really worried, and rightfully so. The money got taken right out of her wallet, after all. Don't like doing this any more than you do, but if one of you stole the money, I need you to speak up. She's looking a bit shifty, isn't she? Mm -hmm. So, the money went missing two days ago. Were there any strangers hanging around? Riona was digging around. Oh, okay. Wow, he just straight up grasped her. <gasps> Ayaka Chan said I could borrow her paint, so I was getting it out of her bag. Okay. Now that I think about it, didn't Mitsuo just buy a new model set? It's a pretty fancy one, too. They're all going to blame each other, aren't they? Mm hmm. Because they stopped buying snacks so we could get his train set. Don't they say the first guy to speak up is usually the one who did it? What was that? You heard me. Stop it, you two. <laughs> Alright, we're done here. This was clearly a mistake. But somebody stole the money, right? Yeah, he's right. Look, we're not going to keep sitting here flinging accusations at each other. That's not what being a family is about. But I'll say it again. If one of you did take the money, you can come talk to me whenever you want. I won't tell the others. It's definitely that. Hmm. The one who wasn't looking. Is it Eri Chan? I can't remember the name. The only thing that accomplished was making everyone doubt each other. Um, as much as I hate to admit it, one of the kids must have stolen it. You're going to look through their things now, okay. Oh. So that is back in this room, I'm guessing. Yeah, there she is. What are you doing in here? <laughs> Nothing. That's Ayako's bag. You know you can't dig around in there without her permission. Putting the money back, potentially. Is there a reason you don't want to say? I'm just wondering where all this is going. Hmm. Uncle Kaz, what's wrong with Eri? I found her looking through your bag. I bet the money's back in there now. Yeah. Oh! No, the money's back in mm -hmm. my wallet. Yeah. So Eri's put the money back, so the fact she was looking shifty... Did that suggest we should go and find her? Yes, I think so. She's probably on the beach. That's where you have these sorts of conversations. Yep. yep. All right, Eri, it's time you told me what's going on. Really sorry. I promised my friends I'd go to the movies with them, but I didn't have any money. Then why'd you promise? I never get to do stuff with them. They have real parents, so they get way more allowance than I do. And you have nine of us to take care of, so I can't ask for more. My friends know I can't afford a lot, so they never ask me to do stuff with them. So when they asked me to go to the movies, I was really happy. I couldn't say no to that, so I just took the money. Mm. Oh. Mm. But you gave the money back, now you've confessed. That's really brave. The next step now is apologising to Ayako. Think you can do that? Because she kind of looks pissed off. She does look rather <laughs> pissed off, doesn't she? Erita. Sir. Ayako 
ちゃんあ私ありがとうそしてごめんえっなんでなんで綾子ちゃんが謝るのほ本当はね私エリちゃんがお金持ってくところ見ちゃってたんだえっでもね私私その場でエリちゃんのこと止めてあげられなかったエリちゃんのことを本当に思ったら私あの場で言うべきだった後悔してるんだあ<笑>私の方がお姉ちゃんなのに勇気がなかった私にもっと勇気があればこんな大きなことにならなかったのにだからごめん私も許して It's not that big well it's not that big a deal But for, for, for kids For kids I suppose it is yeah. Come on, you two. Let's get back inside. I've got curry to eat. What's wrong? Everyone's so angry. It's fine. We'll sort it. Nobody's going to hate anyone. I'll tell you what. Leave the talking to me. What I need you two to do is... Got it? Mm -hmm. Still need to do fishing at some point, but yeah, I kind of want to progress the story to like <laughs> yeah. see where all this is going. <laughs> Everyone's in the dining room really quickly by the looks of it. Listen up, we got Ayako's money back. Then you know who the thief is? Not so fast, I actually have to apologize to all of you. Why? Well, Eri came to me yesterday saying she found some money, but I guess it slipped my mind today. Seriously, Eri? Where'd you find it? Um, in the yard. And how much was it? 1,000 yen, which is exactly how much you were missing, right, Ayako? Yeah. Meaning there's a good chance the money Eri found yesterday is the same money that went missing from Ayako's bag. There's no other possibility, don't you guys think? Oh, he's covering for her. Bless. Yeah. <laughs> so then nobody stole the money. Why was I getting blamed for it? I'm sorry, Mitsuo. All this could have been avoided if I just remembered sooner. Everyone, I'm really sorry. Oh. Sorry is not good enough. Yeah, I got called a thief. Yeah, me too. Hold on, guys. Wait, I'm the one who dropped the money, so if you're going to get mad at anyone, get mad at me. I should have said something sooner too. I'm really sorry, everyone. See, Uncle Kaz was just a little forgetful. I think we should be glad none of us turned out to be thieves. Oh. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> sorry, it's obviously just a bit of an attitude. I probably deserved it for how I treated Koji. Hey, it's in the past. Good, can we all eat now? He needs to cook it first. I'm starving. Food. <laughs> Make it snappy. All right. Cheeky sort. <laughs> Try not to eat the table while we're gone. Why don't you all go play outside while we cook? Well, guess we better get started. Don't tell me this is going to be like a cooking mini game or something. Oh, no. Right. Okay. Uh, uh, Alright, are we cooking? Uncle oh, Kaz, Tai-Chi's. Uncle Kaz? What's wrong, Tai Chi? <clears throat> I'm sure it's probably Tai Chi rather than Tai Chi, but mm. I just can't help but say Tai Chi. It's that guy with the curly hair, I just saw him again. Are you sure? Yeah, he's in that blue truck, probably oh, spying great. on us again. It's definitely him. Alright, I'll handle it. Make sure everyone gets inside. I'm gonna go take a look outside. Think you can handle dinner? Of course. 
Hmm. So I mm. thought we'd resolved it. Well, I mean, we hadn't quite. It wasn't resolved. We was sort it? of. We. Am I going the wrong way again? Yeah, I think, I think I am. you might have done. Yeah, you go out the go out that way, way. You're right. It's not resolved because you basically told them. We warned the elder guy, didn't we? Mm-hmm. Uh. Where's this blue car that they've just talked about then? I don't know. I should go outside and see what's up. But first, there's a box that might have a prawn in it. I don't see him anywhere. Maybe Tai Chi was wrong. Hmm. Hmm. Or maybe he's been and gone and something's happened. wonder what we're going to get this time. Yep, we're taking it. There's it's a, a lobster. lobster in the box. <laughs> it's lovely. I guess we'll keep it. Smashing. Okay. All right. So, um, right. Let's just go back. Curiouser and curiouser. Mm. Something gonna happen now that you get back. Yeah, maybe. Everyone inside now. Hey, uh. またお前か。俺の答えは変わってねえぞ。いや。今日はそういうんじゃねえんです。Is it's got to do with the little lady. You mean the girl with the spe sketchbook? Yeah. Two nights ago, she just disappeared. Nobody knows where she could have gone. I think she ran away? Don't know, we've got men searching the streets, but they haven't found so much of a trace of her yet. And have you gone to the police? Well, not exactly. Why not? Yeah. There's uh, something suspicious about it, I'm guessing. I don't know that we really can file a missing persons report. What do you mean? Well, the truth of it is, she's the daughter of the guy the boss used to do business with. Now the boss is taking care of the girl, but he never officially adopted her. If the cops found out about that, they'd ship her back to her parents, no questions asked. And we don't want that. Right, okay. Right. Saki-san's parents are real scum of the earth, let me tell you. Her dad gambled all their money away and then some, then would come home stinking of booze and beat the daylights out of the girl and her mum. Lovely. Her mum, on the other hand, was always sleeping around. Acted like she didn't want a damn thing to do with her. So sounds like a wonderful <sighs> parenting couple wow. there. Wow. Poor girl. <laughs> so then Nakahara took Saki in to protect her. Yeah. Three years back, we got asked to collect on her dad's gambling debt. So the boss went over to the house, but when he walked inside, he found the guy dead. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. And her mum... Hurry off with one of her fuck boys. Lovely. Right. Which is why Nakahara took her in. The boss looks scary, sure, but he's got a good heart. Just wasn't in him to leave her like that. And yeah, he complained at first about how much trouble it was raising a kid, but it wasn't long till he ended up a proud father. Now he treats Saki-chan like she's his own flesh and blood. That's amazing. Yep, but word has it her mum's back in town that she wants to take Saki-san back. Why? If why? she's so, like, so yeah, bothered. Yeah, why now? <laughs> Beats I me. I hardly bothered but about her before. Yeah, well, there you go. Right. Anyway, the boss has been trying to keep the little lady in the office so her mum wouldn't be able to find her. Which is why she was there when I stopped by. Yep. And now she's missing, the boss is real worried. Saki's not a child anymore, though. Couldn't she just call him if she needed to, unless she's been held against her will? Mm -hmm. Call him? Not a chance in hell. Why not? The girl's mute. Oh. Well, there you go. That explains why she hasn't said anything up to now. The doctor said it's some kind of mental block. This sounds familiar. You won't know, but Yakuza Zero. That's what happens with Makoto. Probably from watching her dad hang himself right in front of her. So you see, she can't call us. And that's why she has the sketchbook. Come on, Aniki, we've got to find her as soon as possible, please. Right, we're going on a, a hunt then, are we? Oh, that's right. Yeah, we're going to have to 
とりあえず親父を落ち着かせてほしいんです、oh. なんで俺なんだ先日の一件から親父は兄貴に一目置いてるみてえですだからここは兄貴しか収められねえとちょっと待てはいさっきから聞いていると俺のことを兄貴兄貴って何言ってるんだだって兄貴は兄貴じゃないですかお前は流動一家の若頭だろいや、yeah. 俺はお前の兄貴分でも何でもない<笑>まあその話はいいとしてよくないお前みたいなやつに兄貴と呼ばれたらうちの子供たちに悪影響だろうが別にいいじゃないですか俺は兄貴の強さと男気に惚れたんです俺にとって兄貴は兄貴なんです<笑><laughs> <laughs> Just like, uh. Kiri, I don't think you got much choice, mate. Let me guess, the kids are all in the doorway. Just like, uh. Okay, maybe not. We're gonna have to walk from here, Aniki. I don't remember agreeing to this. <laughs> well, come this far. Let's get moving. Alright, stop、fine. calling me Aniki. Yeah. Hopefully, little pink, bo- pink spot pink on the map. Spots appear on the edge. Uh... Right. Oh, hang on. Have I gone the wrong way? Yep, looks like it. I've assumed that I'm going in there, but maybe I'm not. What's T? e a I have no idea. Uh, me neither. What open? Something at the space of open. Taxi. A velo taxi? Nowhere, Nowhere just yet. Oh, so the T is the taxi. Cool, good to know. Left. Into this shifty looking alleyway.、Mm. Oh, it's just a different way to get here. Okay, cool. Okay. Oh, he looks like he's been beaten up. Ah, Kashira, Kiryu no, ah, Anki. Where's your? Where's the boss? Look at this. Sakima de Amori no de Abarete. Oh, you're gonna end up having to beat him up to get him to see sense. Maybe. It wouldn't surprise me if that's the only way it works. Oh, dear. I can't see us fighting him though. He did have a massive sword earlier on though. Yeah, but. What do you want this time? Sorry, I'm not in the mood to talk about your little land problem. Oh, that's Rickier for you. Never know, knows when to keep his damn mouth shut. This ain't your problem. Well, it is now. Why, why don't you go look, look for her? <laughs> Can't. Wouldn't be so miserable if it was that easy. What do you mean? She ran away because she didn't want to live with me anymore. I'd just scare her off if I went hunting for her now. You don't know that for sure. Why don't you try to figure out why she really ran away? It wouldn't be too late to catch up to her if you go now. Maybe Saki just wanted to see her mum again after all this time. Same difference. Either she wants to be with her mum or she doesn't want to be with me. God damn it. Am I really worse than that miserable whore? Jumping to conclusions a bit. Yeah, a little bit. The hell do you know? You think you're some kind of kid expert just because you run a fucking orphanage? I know enough. I was an orphan myself. Not only that, the man who raised me was in the Yakuza. And since I have no memories of my birth parents, that man is more of a father than I've ever had. He might have been a Yakuza, yeah, but I loved him all the same. And I'm sure Saki loves you too, but it's natural for her to miss her mum. She's still just a kid. You think? Of course. Now get out there and find her before someone else does. 
can't. Why not? Look at me. Why would she ever want to come back to this mess? Just going to have to face the fact she's gone. You really think so? Yeah, I do. Oh, oh dear. Wakata.俺が先から話を聞いてやる。え、なんでお前さんが俺もな。あんたと一緒で目の前に困っている<笑> Such a sweetie. Stop calling me Aniki! <laughs> Just waiting for it to snap. What are you doing? Find Saki. Find Saki. Thanks for talking to him. If we're really going to look for her, I don't have the slimmest idea of where to start. Well, that's just great. We just have to ask around. We can focus on the air and rise around the office for now. Nobody's seen her. Uh. Where does her mum live? No idea. <sighs> Only stone left unturned is Hatsumachi. It's the biggest red light district on the island. Chock full of hostess clubs, brothels... All sorts of smart kids are not going to go anywhere near. Besides, what? It's Tamashiro family turf. Let's go! Yep, yeah, we're going settled. There. We're going there. Don't care whose turf it is, we're going. Well, you're welcome to stay behind if you think they're that scary. I'm coming, Aniki! Okay, good. Now let's go. <laughs> so there is another family in town as well, then. Okay. Yeah. Uh, is it going to show me on the map? No. Hatsumachi. It, it's not. Maybe okay. go and check the taxi, because there's a taxi right outside, yeah. so he we'll, might we'll take you there. Can... Okay, maybe not. Nope. So where the frick is this? You can ask around. Well, he might even tell you. I'm coming with you. Let's go to Hatsumachi. And... Yeah, okay, great, but, but... where? <laughs> Where where have we been and what, so hang on. Oh, the checkpoint. I keep forgetting the C is where we aim for, even though... Is it the C, is it? Because it's always been like the little pink bit. But yeah, but it's also the C appears as well. I oh, think okay. it's that. Right, so I'll just... I'll take for it. Yeah, so down... Down here, I think. That, not down there. There's a group of people here. Man on a business trip. We're done with work. Let's go find one of those hostess clubs I've heard so much about. Haven't seen any around here though, have you? wonder where the red light district is. Me too. Gentlemen, you two looking for a hostess club? Then you need to get yourselves over to Hatsumachi. Where's that? North, North up Kitaru Street. And cross over the river. Can we follow you? Can we get a lift? Uh, how do we get a lift with you? Uh, I'm not sure okay. you do, or you just follow the directions, so north right, on the... Right, so, n over that way, near the top save point, I'm guessing. Mm -hmm. Right, let's do it. Can I run any faster? Oh, I can I zoom can. the map. Don't appear to be able to run any faster. I also don't know why. It... Ah, shit! <laughs> <laughs> Worried old woman. Ricky, oh, thank God it's you! Something terrible's happened. All right, calm down and tell me what's going on. It's Saki chan. Oh, what about her? I saw her in Hatsumachi with some woman I've never seen before. Oh dear. Mm hmm. Are you sure it was her? Well, if it isn't the dashing, dashing young, young fella from, from before. before. This must be fate. Come on, we don't got time for your hopeless flirting. Let's try and focus. Where did you see her? Coming out of the convenience store over at the intersection with some woman who is absolutely dressed to the nines. A hostess. 
Hmm. Oh, are they recruiting her for like underground brothel stuff? I hope not. Maybe Saki's mother. Party? Oh shit, it's the boss's birthday. He's not going to be in any mood for celebration if we can't find Saki though. Then we're not doing ourselves any favours by standing around. Come on, let's go. Come on. Right. Uh, up. Up. <laughs> so you cross the road. Up, oh, fuck. Where are you going? Where am I going? <laughs> oh. This way. Up. <laughs> up. That way. That way. <laughs> Shushu. <laughs> right. Across the river. This is the river. Mm -hmm. I am loving Okinawa, though. Like, I, I really like it's it. It's definitely a change of, uh, change so of pace pretty. compared to Kamurocho, isn't it? Is it a real place or a fictional place? Let us know in the comments. Ah, we've got the pink uh, yes, dot now. Yes, we do. Right. Right Let's next to a save see. point, apparently. Yes. Let's see what's going on here. Businessman. My presentation went great. Time to celebrate with some tantakatan. Don't know what that is. Is that the shochu made from perilla leaves? All the girls at the office are obsessed with it. We usually mix it with cranberry juice. Uh, okay. I should remember this when I'm over at a cabaret club. Uh, okay. That's not what I needed to do. Where am I going? Up this way. That way. That convenience <laughs> store, I think. Ah, why can't I do things? Okay, you there. In, In the, the kitchen, kitchen shirt. shirt. Which one? <laughs> we both are. Oh, shit. Who are you? Me? Who the fuck are you? I knew you were about to get shown who is. Tamashiro? Sorry, never heard of him. Bullshit, it's clear as the damn Okinawa sky what you do for a living. Tell the truth, and even if I was a Yakuza, I'm not here looking for trouble. I suggest you leave us alone. Or else. Wait, is that Ricky about there? Your little game of hide and seek's not going to work on me, Rayudo asshole. <laughs> not Yakuza my ass. If you weren't Yakuza, you wouldn't be spending your time with this Rayudo sap. You're here to take the brat back. Ooh. Mm. Don't got time for 20 questions, bitch. It's been a while since the fight, you remember how to do it. <laughs> oh, they're just family grunts, so I think we're okay. Come here. <laughs> nice start. Yep. Oh. Come on down. Oh, nice. and he's, just head he's a bit you. of a he's a bit of a big bugger. Not very good at blocking, by the looks of it, no. until now. I'm gonna get him last. Ow! Okay, I'm gonna not get. Oh, he doesn't like being grabbed. <laughs> no, he's just kicking one. <laughs> right. <clears throat> Ow! I'm gonna grab you. You're annoying me. Stamp on his face, yes. <laughs> oh, <f> <laughs> what are you doing? Right, let's build up my heat. Now. He's down. I know. I'm going to get him oh, over dear. the uh, railings, because that's <laughs> always fun. Okay, where's this last one? Come here, you. Punk. Shit, this guy really eats his spinach, huh? I love that this is dude in the background just like going about his business. La, 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 la. So, are you ready to talk now? Tell me about this brat you mentioned. Look, we didn't take nobody. Some bitch claiming to be the girl's mother brought her in. Oh, great. <gasps> she can't try to sell her. Duh, the tramp's sleeping with the boss. Probably doesn't realise she's just another notch on the bedpost. In other words, you have no reason to keep Saki. Give her back. Look, we don't have her in a cage or nothing. She and her mum could be anywhere. Yeah, I think there's more to this than uh, meets the eye. Hmm. Where's the Tamashiro office? Are you out of your mind? We can't just go in there, just the two of us. It's on the street behind the convenience store. You heard the man, Ricky. Come on. Right, well, before we go and take down the boss, I think we should save there. <laughs> um, so I ho hope you've enjoyed that episode, and we will see what 
what's in store for us at the Tamashiro family office in the next episode. Till then, bye. See ya.